Hopefully you got to enjoy the scattered showers and thunderstorms over the past few days. From this point on, we are entering into a drier and warmer period. I'm meteorologist Dr. Athena Masson. For your afternoon, those temperatures soaring up into the 90s, 95 degrees by 2 p.m. Now we're not eliminating rain chances completely. They're just going down to scattered to isolated for the next few days. Best chance to see them would be in the early part of the afternoon before drying out in preparation for the evening under partly to mostly cloudy skies. Factoring in our heat index values, yes, our air temperatures may be in the low to mid 90s. Still going to be feeling about 10 degrees warmer in some areas, feeling like 109 degrees in Gainesville, Ocala, down towards the villages, 111 in Crystal River and up towards Cross City. We did see some heat advisories be put into effect Monday. This will likely take place again for today and even last into Wednesday because for the next few days we are in this dry and warm pattern. It's all thanks to this high pressure system making its way right over the southeast United States. That's inhibiting any showers and thunderstorms from developing around the region. Now there's still a little bit of moisture in the atmosphere. So once again, not eliminating rain chances. They are just going to go down to scattered. We're also monitoring what could become Hurricane Laura by Wednesday morning, right in the central part of the Gulf of Mexico. It poses no threat to the state of Florida. That system will continue off towards Texas and and Louisiana here in north central Florida. We will continue to remain dry for the next few days. It's not going to be until Friday that we see the return of our rain chances for the next few days. Enjoy temperatures in the low to mid 90s on our heat index values easily. Each day could be in the triple digits.